Now, hello guys, or what is up? My name is Dan the Delight, and today I'm bringing you an AMAF NDA FIFA 23 player review. This is the left midfielder, um, and he is 5'8, medium, medium on the work rates, right footed, four star skill moves, four star weak foot, which is very nice indeed. Of course, this is a foot fantasy card, so that means that he can get an increase based on his real life team. Uh, results and his appearances so this car could end up being really really solid to be honest um, he's 86 overall and um, let's get into the in-game stats shall we so he's got 94 pace which is pretty ridiculous um, 96 acceleration on there um, 81 shooting which isn't too bad um, would like an increase on that for sure 80 passing with the 85 short passing 88 dribbling with 96 agility 87 composure is really really nice um, only 62 defending but he is an attacking player so we don't really need um, high defending anyway and then 79 physical um, of course the strength there is a little bit low um, in comparison to the other physical stats so hopefully that will get an increase if his team can perform so let's get into the actual gameplay with him and see how we get on all right so we've got one one here um hopefully we can actually start to get some goals and, and take control of this game here's trippier on the ball um we need to get it to our new guys got two new players in the team today um both fantasy both doing uh, doing a re review on both of these players um, so hopefully we can get a goal of at least one of them. Here is one of them, and here is the other. Oh, we got one on the break here. Lariente, I think that's how you say his name, and he's away. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Great tackle from him there. Unfortunately, didn't quite manage to do anything. I should have done probably a little bit better there. He just absolutely clattered him there. <laughs> I'll take that all day long. Very happy with that tackle. He's got that Diaby. This card, man, it is rapid. It is so fast. Makes Trippier look like a slouch. Good tackle there. Oh, we need to get it up to the, the forwards. Um, I want to get these guys in the game as much as possible um, because obviously we uh, we want to get some goals or assists with these guys um, and, and test them out. Of course, I, here he is. Oh, not a lot there, to be honest. I do always say I will play more games than just the one that you're watching here. Um, normally try and get about four or five games with these guys to really test them out and see how they are going to play for me. But just hope that we can do something good. They're not that expensive, the two that we've got up for review here. Oh. Um, so, yeah, I'm hoping that that will uh, mean that they should be good value for money, especially with an upgrade. And that's what I like about this fantasy. I like um, promos that are based on real life performances. I, f I just think that adds a bit to um, the FIFA. I really enjoyed that with the road to the final, uh, with the World Cup cards. That's half time there. Let's get into the second half. All right, so here he is. Um, I don't know, his name says Amaf, which is his first name. Uh, I don't know why it doesn't say his second name. Um, but oh, great play there. And he's got him through there, Loriente. How's he not finished that? <laughs> that was one on one with the keeper. He had the whole goal to aim for. <sighs> I should have finished that one. I feel like that's a bit annoying. I thought that we uh, we were going to go two one up there. Um, very unfortunate. He put it wide, like way wide. I don't really know what that was all about. Poor finishing. I, man, I was uh, definitely hoping that that one would have ended up in the back of the net. Ooh, header over the bar. That looked dangerous. That was coming at me. Um, a good what can we do here not an awful lot to be honest we can't seem to get it up to the oh here we go all right nda and best can we get it over to one of these two come on boys oh good run and lariente ah there we go he's made up for his earlier mishap and puts the ball in the back of the net and that puts us 2-1 up really really solid goal that one as well um, very happy with that and uh, yeah 2-1 of course very happy we want to get the win um, and he's actually scored both goals the first one wasn't that great though um, it was like a, a easy tap in it was literally just a pass over and tap into an empty net so not an awful lot was done in that one but that second goal there was a fantastic goal and uh, he has made up for his earlier mistake Oh, unlucky best. Couldn't quite get it up to a math. I'm going to just call him a math because that's the name I see on the screen. Even though his, his name, well, I guess his name is a math. That's his first name, but his surname is India. Uh, and, oh, no, we've just gifted the ball straight back to Garincha, who has been causing me some problems. He didn't really do an awful lot in that first half. Well, he did, but not in the bits that you saw. Um, in, the, uh, in the half where... The first half of the first half, I guess. Oh, that's a good ball there. And Best has put him through. Ah, referee. Seriously? 
he's just absolutely wiped me out there. I was away, um, and unfortunately, the ref's probably only going to give a yellow card for that one as well because it wasn't, yeah, wasn't that close to the um, to the goal. But let's try it. I mean, he's got t decent enough power, but um, <laughs> that's about it. Ah, yeah, no way. That was never going to trouble the keeper. I don't know why I even tried that, to be honest. But, you know, when we're within a play, we might as well see what he's got in all aspects. But he's away here. Oh, that was a terrible pass. Oh, he's won it back. Well, they pretty much gifted it back. Let's try the finesse here. What a goal that is. What a finish. And that is 3-1. He's going to quit here by the looks of things. There we go. Brilliant. All right, so you saw um, him there just get a goal right at the very end. Very nice goal at that. And uh, let's go through it stat by stat, and then we'll give our overall final verdict. So the 94 pace, I'm actually going to think that it's probably about right, to be honest. His pace felt really nice. Um, so I'm going to leave that at 84. I think that his shooting can probably be increased. Um, it's only 81 on the card. I feel like that finesse goal that he scored was just one of a couple that he scored very similar. Um, I'm going to bring his shooting up to an 84. I think 81 just seems way too harsh. His passing at 80 probably feels about right. I did notice that there were some times where it did sort of go laps and, and perhaps didn't have the power that you feel like it, it probably should have when you, you know you're holding the button down. You kind of get a feel for how the power should be. His just felt like he needed to hold it a little bit longer. So I'm going to leave that at 80. 88 dribbling on the other hand, that can that can definitely stay at 88 as well. Really, really solid dribbling. Um, um, and I just, I, d I definitely think that 88 feels about right. Really, really good dip, uh, dribbling. 62 defending, I'm not going to touch because he is a forward player. And then 79 for the physical, I think we can actually increase that as well. His strength was not a problem. I didn't notice anything bad about his strength and 79 just seems a bit too low. So I'm going to increase his physical up to an 82. So, you know... It's, it's not an expensive player whatsoever. These players can get increases, these fantasy players. So do I think he's worth paying the money for? Yeah, I actually do think he probably is worth paying the money for with some increases. I mean, this guy could end up with ridiculous pace, good shooting and ridiculous dribbling as well. I think that he's definitely worth buying, keeping hold of and uh, and then selling in the future. You know, it's not it's not a big risk with this guy because he, he costs such a little amount anyway. You might not want to use him just yet, but definitely one for the future. So hopefully this video has helped. If it has, please do give it a thumbs up. Hit the subscribe button for more videos like this. There will be a link in the description down below full of FIFA 23 player reviews. As always, guys, thank you for watching. Bye-bye.